a car upside down, sliding way down the back straightaway. One machine getting upside down and sliding. Connie Saylor in car number four has gone upside down. The Johnson City, Tennessee campaigner in an Oldsmobile has slid almost 2,000 feet after getting in trouble in turn number two. Connie Saylor, who started his Grand National campaign in 1978, in trouble, let's look at it in replay. It looks like he was tagged at the start of that, David, and look at that car fly. Well, as they come off that turn two again, the car spun around, and when it started to go down the road backwards, for some reason, the rear got off the floor. Once it was up, the air gets underneath these machines and just flips it right over onto its roof and slides down the straightaway there. Luckily, no fuel leakage, otherwise those sparks from the roof would have obviously caught fire. The fuel cell doing its job as Connie Saylor has had a serious crash again coming out of turn number two. The race is going to end under caution and Sailor is walking away. Another disastrous crash and Connie Sailor extricates himself and walks into the infield. Another vivid demonstration of the incredible strength of these 3,700 pound NASCAR cars. Here we see it again. As you can see, those cars are very close together and it looks like he's just tagged as they come off to then you see the car just spins around and lifts itself up into the air, does a graceful roll, comes down on the roof and just continues at almost unabated speed, probably still doing 115, 120 miles an hour down that back stretch. Luckily, everybody else missed him. He took a diagonal run across the road on the roof and everybody else following up luckily missed him. The GC Spencer car destroyed. Connie Saylor again is all right. It is the second car that we have seen attempt to fly coming down the back straightaway here in this first 125 mile race. This race is ending in a caution after Connie Saylor's car has parts strewn all down the back straightaway here at the Daytona International Speedway. Well, this will be realizing the fears of many of these drivers this week. These cars are less stable than the older models. They're shorter, narrower. Their aerodynamics aren't so good, and it looks as if their fears could be well-grounded. Checkered flag is out for Bobby Allison. 